All right, everyone, so a couple of videos ago, if you haven't seen it already, I picked up a Yamaha PW50 pit bike for free. Now, if you haven't seen that video, the link will be in the description, but if you did see it, then you would know that it does have a couple of issues. So this was to be expected as a free pit bike that was just basically not used for years and years. But the two big problems with it is that one, the spark plug is completely gone, as you can see there, or the spark plug like cable, whatever it's called. And two, in here, there is a fuel filter which is leaking very badly. And today we're gonna to be fixing both of these issues. Now, I have right here the spark plug cable to be replaced and then that should be all working fine, but what I don't have is the fuel filter. Now, I did buy one for £2.50 off like Euro car parts, but it's the wrong one, which is annoying. So what we're gonna to have to do is take the one off here and go and go around a couple of motorcycle shops like that and see if they have one in stock because delivery at the moment on ebay is awful so without further ado let's pull this little bike out and get this fuel filter off okay so i'm just going to lean the bike up here so it's a bit lighter so i can see what i'm doing take these two bolts off get this seat off and then the fuel filter should be able to easily just hopefully pull off Okay, so if you have a look here, this is the little fuel filter and you can see it is completely cracked. So um, if we open this, you can see that drips out. Whoa, that is a big leak. But yeah, that is massively where it is leaking from, obviously. So we're gonna hopefully just pull these tubes off. So yeah, let's quickly take this off. And just like that, the filter is now out and we need to go and find another one now in a, in a part shop. So uh, yeah, let's now go and hop in the car and get this new filter. All right, so in the car, it comes in there. Keep that safe in the cup holder. And um, now. That sound never gets old. Boy, you gotta love the sound of this thing. All right, so on the way now to the first destination and hopefully fingers crossed they have a fuel filter in the stock it's also a saturday so hopefully they're open i haven't actually checked that oh, that is stupid right we are pulling up to the place now to hopefully find this fuel filter and they're closed of course they are all right i found another place 15 minutes away so i'm gonna head there now and hopefully they have it in stock. I've seen that they're open online. Woo! Right, I'll see you there in five minutes. All right, everyone, I've just been to another motorcycle shop and look what I've got. A brand new fuel filter, identical to the one that's come off it. So, let's go back now and let's fit this to the bike and, uh, yeah. We are now back with the new fuel filter and uh, that as you can see went in there but now that can go and this new one can go in there and then we have the spark plug to do so yeah without further ado and just like that the fuel filter is in and if we turn the tap on you can see there is no leak whatsoever i did quickly just test it then but look at that no leak anymore so that is one fix done and that is probably one of the biggest ones as well because this thing was getting literally fuel all over it when you're riding it so uh, that is a good fix and um yeah the tubes are all on as far as they will go but now we're gonna have to try and get this off okay so i've managed to get both the bolts out of there as you can see and that now is loose and ready to be pulled out i think i might have to what the hell all right everyone i've spent about half an hour an hour on this and we've got bad news because everything apart from the fuel filter has gone wrong so as you can see the fuel filters all in nicely um, but this uh, uh, this doesn't unplug right so this runs down into there and all sorts so I don't know how to do that if you didn't see last video I said that I, I have no idea what I'm doing like, I don't know what I'm doing this is like the first bike I'm working on and when I saw this wire run down into the engine and being attached to all that I was like definitely not so I tried to put this back on uh, that screw went in fine. That one, 
just won't go in the thread. The thread must be busted. So that's only got one screw now. And then we come around here. I'll try to just do the cap, just put a new cap on this. So what I did was get my old spark plug. So what I did is get my um, the new spark plug that I bought, and I watched a video on how to change a spark plug cap. The guy said just pull the end off of the of the, of the spark plug. So I did that, and this happened. Now that's happened. So I thought, right, that's not great. So what I'll do is open up the end cap, and then what happened is it's not a normal thing. I don't know what this is. It's a spark plug, but it's different to the video I watched. So that is just I don't know what's happened to there. So. That is now destroyed. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's it. Oh wait, no, it gets worse because we thought the leak was fixed and it is in that place, but if we run down here, there's no tube on there. I don't know how long that's been missing, but there is no tube on it. So it just drips out of there. So I don't know how I'm gonna repair this, to be honest. I'm gonna have to look at videos online and all things like that and Maybe you order some other stuff for it. But yeah, this is such a complicated little thing. I don't know what. I'm going to watch some videos and stuff to see if I can somehow do it. But if you guys can give me a hand, I'll send links down in the comments or whatever on stuff I, could need, I need to buy for it. Or whatever, just give it help me, please. I have no, no idea what I'm doing. Oh, yeah, look, here we go. You can see it's dripping. Oh, it's dripping from in there as well. It's dri The thing's dripping from everywhere. I mean, there is a million fuel leaks on this thing. That's now dripping in a new place, which it, it didn't drip at didn't trip there five seconds ago. It was going really well until then, until I found another fuel leak and the spark plug went. Anyway, this is gonna have to be a project for another day now, because I don't have the stuff for it, and um, yeah.